Hi everyone, my name is Umaima and today I'm going to talk about the elephant in the world, transportation issues. My title, my presentation title is Eco-Friendly Transportation Self-Driving Cars. For a long time, automobiles have played a fundamental role in our lives, provide many benefits to society, whether in trading, cultural development, sport and even wars. It has been a source of innovations and economic growth. The transfer that automobiles have recorded could be considered as the fastest during the last century. Some scientists say that automobile and tractor needed only 50 years to replace animals from public transport and farms throughout North America. However, this transition wasn't inviable or smooth, nor was it particularly beneficial. Will Rogers described it in a few words. He said, you never heard of a horse going broke beating on people. Since this transfer innovation within the automotive industry has brought significant technological advances leading to safer, reliable, more affordable and cleaner cars. <coughs> Since Henry Ford introduced the moving assembly line, the changes have been incremental, evolutionary. Hence, this industry initiates to have a revolutionary change with the potential to dramatically reshape not just the competitive landscape but also the way we interact with cars. As well, the future design of our roads and cities. Sequently, the automotive horizon has accelerated and provided an advanced era that depends on the consumers, their needs and their preferences. This development will lead the transportation futures. Self-driving cars describe a technological leap forward that can propose solutions to current transportation problems and could change how people address mobility. Various researchers argue that self driving cars have the potential to improve safety and enhance the quality of life. Conversely, many people or drivers are unwilling to adopt the new technology as it's not common for humans to have no control besides they are dealing with safety as an big issue. Moreover, this technology determines that the truly transformative benefits are only realized once the public adopts self-driving cars. According to the National Highway Traffic Safety Administrations, self-driving cars is the cars in which operation occurs without direct driver's input to control the steering, acceleration and braking. In this type of car, the driver is not expected to constantly monitor the roadway while operating in self-driving mode. This definition assumes that the car will always have a driver. However, this is, isn't essential. Autonomous technologies are already able to perform all the required function for a car to move safely from A to B without anyone on board. Automobile industry's development has recorded different stages of four vehicle driving levels. Level zero, where car have no automation, everything was controlled by mechanical means, up to promising stage level 5, where the vehicle is fully autonomous in all environments and conditions. As mentioned before, the dramatic changes the autonomous vehicles will address, a world in which travel is affordable or could be free, driving towards different destinations could be an experience that passengers or drivers could utilize their time to do any activities while the car is driving itself. However, in order to change our current state of travelling to the one futuristic car is promising. There are many technical, social and regularity barriers that we should overcome to adopt the revolution of autonomous vehicles. Most of self-driving cars being driven and tested driven today are already fully electric. Self-driving cars use significantly less gas and energy when driving. Compared to a vehicle driven by a human, most gas is burned when driving at high speeds braking and re-accelerating. Self-driving cars cut these factors out of their driving style, meaning less gas is heated or battery power consumed, resulting in less air pollution. Transportation Society of America predicts that autonomous vehicles can reduce oil consumption by 2 to 4 percent over the next 10 years as intelligence transport system. It also means fewer cars per household. This reduces the overall number of vehicles on the road as well as unnecessarily overlapping trips that contribute to emissions will be less. Moreover, as driverless car technologies is advanced, the weight of the car will drop as a result of lighter batteries and less need for heavy 
safety modification to the engine. Safety driving cars are undoubtedly a benefit for the planet. Not only will they help curb emissions, reduce fatalities over human and wildlife, and allow city planners to focus on green space more than roads, they will also give every commuter more time in their days. While self-driving cars have the potential to improve safety and enhance the quality of life, many people appear reluctant to adopt the technology due to safety and control issues. The self-driving car concept needs a new technique of communication to overcome the challenge of earning the trust of the future customers. As they found the demand in the market and the future investment in infrastructure, the user interface is fundamental to the way people perceive the driving experience. Innovative means for user interface development and interaction design are required to expedite the adoption of technology. General Motors' former vice president talked about two driving factors that will shape the future of automobile, energy and connectivity, adding a third factor, which is control. If we address these three factors, we might be able to bridge the gap between how we drive today and how we will drive in the future, and thus create a more cohesive future automated driving system. The need for adopting a novel user interface system is due to two factors. First is about the current visual interaction would not be valid for future users as it does not meet and communicate the alerts efficiently between the car and the passenger. Mm. Second, with the potential of having different passengers on board with different needs and capabilities, for instance, they may have vision and hearing impairments, they may be blind or partly sighted, the user interface should employ multimodal outputs to guarantee sufficient communication with the passengers. Good communication between vehicle and passenger accommodates when to trust or not to trust automated systems. In this context, it's essential for the automated systems to convey the sense of intelligence awareness, able to take control at any time or even to give instructions about how to drive within the passenger's comfort zone. Achieving such result is a through comprehensive human machine interface present effective communication with the end user. The user interface needs to tell what its utility, how to use those features and why these functions are fundamental in the design. A key component of immersive user experience is explicity. For drivers, a fraction of second can be variation between getting into an accident or driving away safely. Study shows that it takes up to eight seconds for a driver to regain situational awareness, more three to four seconds for reaction time. During this time, the possibility of collusion is significantly increased. While recent cars, technologies, propped with safety features like backup camera blinking and sensors, there are different types of driver distraction impede the ability to spot hazards and react in time. Evidence explains that the distraction caused by mobile phones, for example, can impair driving performance in many ways. The core of this three years project presents a distinct human machine interface that could meet the customer's requirements while they are practicing any activities in the ride. The essential question to ask how to design the system that make driving safer while providing for the user's needs. What can make the car generally effective at changing the behaviours of the user? A fundamental element of user experience for in-car technology is a clarity. The user interface design features can have a measurable impact on how legible the in-car experience is. Various factors like illumination, colours and typeface do contribute to understanding what makes a legible driving experience for drivers and passengers. A simple example of information interaction when the system notifying the passenger about the car intention to change the planned route because of traffic or any other obstacles is to show the navigation path in advance so that the passenger can take educate actions if they disagree. Such a solution could be demonstrated through the advanced heads-up display, which can adjust for parallax effect based on the passenger head position and movement display these directions and instructions 
on the windshield. 3D map to the road ahead instead of static route. While designing immersive user experience, there are internal and external factors have to be considered, such as colors, illumination, polarity as external factors, where weight, stroke, size modulation case, and font type are internal factors. These factors contribute directly to the system clarity. It is important to understand that what people engage with depends on how it meets their ongoing activities as well as whether they realize its potential value. The design of systems that support active engagement will ideally take account of people's practices and context as well as their interest. Good design can facilitate productive interaction with information. So, from the notion of the paradigm shift by Thomas Cohen, who states that people do not shift unless they have a vision of what it is they are shifting to, we believe in this project. Employing the generated design into self-driving cars would help us to bridge the gap between different autonomous levels and the fully autonomous level acceptance and most importantly, would provide more safe, sustainable and green transportation system. Though the bright future of the driving cars industry promising any revolutionary technology has unintended impacts, such as the cost of self-driving car would be substantially higher than the average car, cyber security will likely be an issue. Many drivers may lose their job due to the usage of autonomous transportation systems. Despite, despite the social impact of self-driving cars, it is important to adopt reliable, safe, eco-friendly transportation systems. Thank you so much for your attention. I'm happy to take your questions.